Welcome to Family Yoga. This video is meant to serve as a reminder for us all that any age, any time can get in a little yoga. So let's get started with a little breath, a little centering, before we start to move that body and get us going. Let's start with one kid leading the pose. So every person will do it a little different and that's okay. We'll be on all fours, we'll be building strength, we'll be pushing away from the ground. We may be in a push-up position or our hips may be lifted towards the sky. The toddlers will join in as they see fit coming in and out of practice, which is encouraged. They learn best by example. We'll continue with upper dog, opening our hearts, opening our chest. Again, more family members may join in as we continue and they see the peace and the strength that we're building. We can then switch to a different kid who will have their own ideas. Now sometimes they need a little time to think of what they want to do, what they want to teach, and that's okay. A little patience goes a long way. And once they decide, of course, we'll all do it. It could be something we're not used to doing. It could be something more fun, like this crab walk on all fours, walking backwards and forwards. Great for the strength, the abdominals, and super fun too. So try it, join in, walk on those hands and feet, walk forward, walk backward, hold it in place. Try lifting one arm and then the other. Have a little fun with it because that's what family yoga is all about. Making yoga fun, making it approachable, and spending time together. When they think of their next pose, again, give them a little time. There's no rush. And when they do, it could be the worm, which if you're pregnant like me, you may not actually do the exact worm, but a variation. And that's okay. Opening the heart, lifting off, pushing away from the ground. Now, sometimes in yoga, there's some little mishaps that happen, especially when all these kids are around. So, when that happens, we as parents stay calm and have fun and encourage some love and encourage some peace and they'll pick them up and they'll comfort them and I chose to keep this part in the video to show that yoga is not you know ABC there is some little chaos there is a little fun and all of that is okay yoga is really about connecting breath body and soul which may not just be a simple pose but it's part of our lives. So when everybody's calmed down and we're all back together, things that bring us together can be our breath. We can practice lion's breath by sticking out our tongue and going, ah! And we can do that a few times as kids will get a little rowdy as the voice gets louder. And then we can get softer, quieter, Sometimes these babes maybe get tired, and that's all right. We'll come back to our breath. We'll come back to the love. As we inhale and exhale, we can all come back to that center place where we started. Inhale and exhale. Oh. Inhale some love. Exhale anything you don't need. Ah, and still, kids will be kids, the toddlers will be toddlers, and all of that is still okay. You know, yoga is not something that's a destination, Yay! it's a journey, one step at a time. So take your time, find out what works for your family, try having each kid come up with their own pose, and always start and begin with the breath. The mama and family in us honors the mama and family in you. Namaste.